The performance of the biceps ulnaris tendon release can be performed intraarticularly at this point by placing a shaver into the location of the subtotal coronoidectomy. That shaver can be used to clean the soft tissue bed in and around the junction between the medial collateral ligament, which is seen here in the center of the picture, and the bicep ulnaris tendon to the left. It is important to free up the synovial attachments between the biceps ulnaris tendon and the exterior joint capsule in this manner. This tendon is broad and extends distally to a degree. It is important to keep the shaver facing towards the tendon as there are neurovascular structures that can be damaged inadvertently with too aggressive or malpositioned shaving. That shaver can also be used between the medial collateral ligament and the bicep ulnaris tendon to further free up that tendon over its insertion length. It may be helpful during this process to increase one's fluid flow to help distend the margin between the joint capsule and the tendon. Once the location is prepared, a standard punch can be placed into the joint. That punch is able to be positioned over top of the bicep tendon and the bicep tendon can be progressively sectioned down along its length. It is important to carefully identify the tendon, to follow the tendon to ensure complete release. At a certain point in this process, vision may be obscured both by the resected portions and collapse. It is beneficial at this stage to remove the punch, place the shaver back into the joint, and suction and shave this area to expose more of the tendon. At this point, it is possible to see the tendon ends have been sectioned and the neurovascular bundle sitting directly adjacent to the shaver tip is exposed. It is advisable the neurovascular bundle is not damaged. It is advisable that the tendon is completely released. Small strands of the tendon can sometimes be identified and may be dealt with as so. This is now a complete release of the bicep ulnaris tendon. Following further suctioning of the joint, the process is completed.